those guys who post the shirtless, like, naked selfies, like, those are not the ones that you want to go on a date with. Spoiler alert, this isn't for the faint of heart, so keep scrolling if you can't handle the most controversial music videos of all time. You're kidding me. Miley Cyrus is known for many things. A lot of them are considered controversial, from her dynamic personality to her public relationships, or going from Hannah Montana to whatever you call this. Miley Cyrus knows how to smash your expectations, sometimes literally. Wrecking Ball by Miley Cyrus was truly a bangers. <laughs> Miley really swung for the fences in this music video, and she did it in the nude. Riding a wrecking ball isn't the only thing to land Miley on the list. Licking hammers, sobbing into the camera, or the most controversial part of this video? Miley working demolition in her underwear. That can't be safe. Luckily, she's wearing steel-toed boots. Second on the list, we have Christina Aguilara. Christina's voice is undeniable. But some critics questioned her image shift in her most controversial music video ever, Dirty. Christina shed her bubblegum pop princess image and also shed her clothes. This video has it all. Chains, leather, leaking pipes that result in a synchronized dance number, and some of the most recognizable sloppy smoky eye makeup of the early 2000s. The greasy apocalyptic underground fight club setting is perfect for the sexual tension that's higher than the featured rappers by Redman. Got we? Sometimes with controversy, there are blurred lines. And sometimes the song is blurred lines. Everybody get up. This music video is so controversial that there's two versions. The only difference? Clothing. The version with clothes is still just as problematic. Maybe it's the middle-aged men talking about pushing boundaries with young females. Maybe it's pretending that it's not sexual assault. Some thought Robin Thicke, T.I. and Pharrell should pay for the music video and the song. Trust me, they did. The trio was accused of copyright infringement when it was noted that their hit was similar to Marvin Gaye's 1977 hit, Got to Give It Up. And that's just what they did. They had to give up millions of dollars to the family of Marvin Gaye. Hashtag blessed. Speaking of blessed, Madonna may have written the book on controversial music videos, but Like a Prayer takes the cake. Or the body of Christ. Who would have thought mixing sex and religion would ruffle some feathers? Madonna became a legend for being controversial, but Like a Prayer really went for the Hail Mary. No pun intended. With church party footage, burning crosses, practicing stigmata, and a depiction of black Jesus 30 years before Kanye had the song. Madonna's Like a Prayer video did not make the Catholic Church happy, but fortunately for us, all is forgiven, and she is hailed as the queen of pop. You think someone else could come up with this? <laughs> and now, for the king of all controversial music videos. Well, the queen, technically. <laughs> Queen's music video for I Wanna Break Free was banned from MTV for cross-dressing. It was later realized that the iconic band was doing a parody of a popular British TV soap opera. Toasty! All right! Queen has always shined in their own unique way, and it's clear that they were ahead of the curve. Speaking of curves, 